Okay, let's go inside. Uh, forgot to mention that we do have these shade and privacy screens in the cockpit. So those are nice. Prop those down and give you lots of privacy. And then, uh, go inside. And get a look. Here's the ice box. This is a minimum of six inches of insulation. You can see the big strap hinges on there. The whole lid lifts up so it's easier cleaning and provisioning, doing what you got to do in there. Uh, otherwise, it's uh, a couple of seals on the door there. This could be cleaned up a little bit, but uh, anyway, yeah, it's a double seal system and uh, lots of uh, lots of space makes ice. And that's what the inside looks like. Double sink, got a three burner cooktop, oven, broiler. This is uh, 18 years old, works like a champ. Nice and clean, well, it keeps it up nicely. Over here, underneath, you can see what it's looking like. There's lots of storage back in the corner. Set to you over here, I'll put the wine rack up here, I'll show you that. Like somebody drank all the wine. And, uh, see your post. Got off a friend's farm. That's a structural part of the boat. Also, a uh, nice little little hat rack there. Table seat, about seven, eight people comfortably. And here's the VHF single sideband. Tuner you saw in the some other excess panels and stuff. This boat has uh, two bilge pumps in either engine room. And, uh, so we've also got an alarm system here in case one one pump won't handle it when the high one comes back on the second pump, then it sounds an audible alarm. Electrical panel here and a queen size berth. We've taken most of the pictures down, so uh, we fill in the holes and paint and do that kind of stuff. Looking down, there's a 40, 40 gallon black water tank under the floor in this cabin, and then there's storage here under this floor in the head. Uh, there's a hanging locker here. See what this is, Levac commode, AK5 whale pump. This system doesn't smell, it's got a porcelain bowl, doesn't absorb odor. And there's some storage. So there's a cabinet here above the, the commode, and that gives you some storage and chain plates for the shroud lines there. The other side of the boat is. A mirror image to this side. Water makers inside right here. Seven and a half gallons per hour. 75 gallon water tank under the sole in this forward cabin. And a storage here, more storage there. Your dresser. Queen size berth here. You got some hiding some of the mast hardware there with that panel, and then this panel is where the windlass switches are located. There's two switches there for the two windlass and the anchor lockers, and a little wire run behind the little pa access panel there. Well, this is a nice feature. This is an underwing vent, and it has a cap that you can screw onto it in the ocean when you're out sailing. Otherwise, that'll let fresh air into the boat, and it passively rolls through the boat and goes out the passive vent that you see in the aft cabin here. And then there's another one up here as well. So that keeps the boat fresh, and the mildew doesn't form. Uh, also with the foam core, it's not uh, not a problem. You notice that we have curtains all through the boat. There's no doors. 
There's no banging or creaking or fingers getting caught. It's lighter and quieter and it's pretty. My mom made the curtains. Another hanging locker. This area back here is being used for, uh, you know, paint and storage and dirty laundry. You can put a mattress back here, what you did in the earlier days, but never used it that way, and so we decided to make it more of a utility room. And then we have another head here, same thing, the Johnny Upper, and then the refrigeration system because it's right underneath the the box above it, so now you can see the Adler Barber right here, and more storage, and this could be, this was a shower seat, and we never completed that because we wanted to have it outside, but there is a well underneath the floor here that could be retrofitted and you know, it could have an inside shower, and then same thing over here. This is the side of the boat that we preside on, or reside on, and uh, you know, once again, we got the underwing uh, vent here, and you can see another queen size berth with uh, television, entertainment section, and the curtains. And so that's pretty much the inside of the boat. sign off. Thanks for visiting.